Welcome to my channel. Today I'm taking you on an exciting journey to one of Norway's hidden gems, Atlanteravsparken and the beautiful Tuenese area in Ålesund. If you're a nature lover or an adventure seeker, this is the perfect spot for you. If you're arriving to Ålesund by cruise ship, the easiest way to get to Atlanteravsparken would be by taking the hop on hop off bus. This takes you straight to the front door of Atlanteravsparken. Buying a day ticket on the hop on hop off also makes it possible to travel to other great locations in and nearby Ålesund. Like the Sundmøre Museum or the Fjellstua lookout point. It's also possible to walk, take a taxi or a local bus. First up, let's explore Atlanteravsparken, also known as the Atlantic Sea Park. This is one of the largest saltwater aquariums in northern Europe and is built right into the coastal landscape at Tuenese. It's a window to the vibrant life along the Norwegian coast and the deep fjords. Here you can observe and learn about the sea life in its natural habitat. Here you can get up close and personal with a wide variety of marine life. From playful otters and majestic penguins to the impressive Atlantic cod and the mysterious wolf fish. There's something for everyone to enjoy. Don't miss the daily feeding show. Watch as the divers feed the fish in the massive Atlantic tank and learn fascinating facts about the marine ecosystem. So I was talking about the safe, the safe or the cold fish, as you can say. This is the fish we got the most in the aquarium. We got the approximately 200 of them inside here. And it all goes from about a half kilos to 20 kilos. But Atlanteravsparken isn't just about the indoor exhibits. Step outside and you'll find stunning views of the Norwegian coastline. The outer area is perfect for a relaxing stroll or a picnic with family and friends. Here you will be able to get up close to the star attractions like the penguins, gifted to the aquarium from Chile. Seal Bay, Europe's largest seal enclosure. And Otter Island, which is the home for two playful otters. Fun fact, the female otter is probably the most expensive otter in the world, as the entire enclosure was built for her alone when the exhibit first opened up. Daily feedings happen at 1 p.m. in the Atlantic tank, 2 p.m. otter feeding, 3.30 penguin feeding, and 3 p.m. seal feeding. Next, let's head over to Tuenesa. This area is known for its scenic walking trails that offers breathtaking views of the ocean and the surrounding landscape. The trails are suitable for all ages and fitness levels, making it a great activity for everyone. As you walk along the trails, you'll come across historical bunkers from World War II. These remnants of the past add a unique touch to your hike and provides a glimpse into the area's history. And if you're looking for the perfect spot to watch the sunset, Tuenesa won't disappoint. The panoramic views of the sun setting over the ocean are simply unforgettable. So whether you're exploring the wonders of Atlanteravsparken or taking in the natural beauty of Tuenesa, this area has something special to offer for all. Thank you for joining me on this adventure. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more travel guides and adventures. As a start, why don't you check out my video on Sundmere Museum, an exciting open air museum well worth the visit. Until next time, happy trails!